Keyword research is important because YouTube isn't just a place where people go to watch videos, it's also a place that people go to to search for things. YouTube is actually the second largest search engine right after Google, who happens to own YouTube. YouTube gets more searches in a day than both Yahoo and Bing combined. So a little keyword research can help draw viewers in based on what they're already searching for. A great place to start with your keyword research is on YouTube itself, starting with the search suggestions. Start typing something in on YouTube and you'll see suggestions pop up automatically. Let's see, if I was making a video about Super Mario Maker, a new video game, you can see there's already suggestions about levels, hardest levels, reviews. So we're already getting just a couple ideas from one search. If you want more in-depth keyword research, you can always go to the AdWords keyword tool. And don't worry, all the links to these resources are in your workbook. Here at the Keyword Planner tool, you can enter in a number of different keywords and get their search volumes on Google. Now granted, this will give you volumes on Google and not YouTube, but you can still find some good insights here, especially if you think your video might rank on Google as well. In this case, I'm getting a lot of suggestions for where to play Super Mario Brothers for free. Another tool I like to use is Google Trends. Here you can enter in a topic or keyword and see how it's trended over the years. The one thing I like about Google Trends is that you can filter your results to just YouTube search. So you can see here, searches for Super Mario Maker have been on the rise since the game was released, of course. But you can always do some fun comparisons as well. Here I have both Luigi and Mario, and clearly Mario is trending higher. We'll type in a keyword like Let's Play, since that's a popular category for video gamers. And you can see that the keyword just by itself is trending pretty well, with a slight plateau. But scrolling down, we can look at some other related searches to that term. You can see that Minecraft is a pretty big game when it comes to Let's Play videos. But we also see Mario in the mix as well. Clicking on one of these keywords helps us drill down into that topic. I also like Google Trends to look at seasonality. I'll type in a term like how to build a deck. You can see that both early and late summer have spikes in that search. So if you're looking to release a how to build a deck tutorial, you might want to do it around April so you can get ahead of the trend. Sometimes doing all this keyword research can seem a bit overwhelming when you're just looking to upload a video. That's why I recommend everybody install a browser plugin called TubeBuddy. By installing the browser plugin, TubeBuddy provides some inline tools in the YouTube experience. So you can see here, as I upload a video, I now see some TubeBuddy tag tools right underneath the tag section. Opening that up, I can enter in a keyword. I can look at some of the most used tags by videos that rank for that term. I can pull up that same trending information from Google Trends and even look at the YouTube and Google suggested keywords all in one place. So those are the tools I like to use to do my keyword research. And since we're here, let's talk about our titles, descriptions, and tags. 